Sadie Rose, today is finally here. One of the closest friendships of my life blossomed into something that I've never experienced before, love. As the years went on, our relationship grew stronger. I said before, I looked up to you when we were younger, but in all honesty, it never stopped. I am forever grateful for having shared these past eight years with you. And can't wait for what the next 80 years has in store for Team Lipke. Hunter, when you had a friend ask me if I like liked you in middle school, I'll admit I played it cool. But inside I was screaming, the cutest guy in Spencer, Wisconsin had a crush on me. One thing that I've learned over the last eight years is that I could not have chosen a better life partner. Our relationship has been full of blessings in disguise. Another lesson I've learned is that home isn't always a place, it's a person. <laughs> and when my whole world was turned upside down, you are my home. Despite the uncertainty we have yet to face, I promise to love and support you endlessly. Through the tough times and the wonderful times, I can't wait to continue living this beautiful life by your side. For those of you that don't know me, I'm sorry, that's your loss. <laughs> For those of you that do know me, you're welcome. <laughs> I'm Brenna, I know Sadie because she was my first roommate at four years old until I was about 18. Sadie, you're hardworking, thoughtful, compassionate, witty, and you always carry yourself with grace. Hunter, I'm so happy to call you my new brother. I couldn't ask for a better match for my sister. Today you start a new chapter, but never forget the two most important replies. Yes, dear, and okay, buy it. Here's a toast to the bride and groom, and for Sadie Bean, Hunter's forever roommate. The most remarkable moment in life is when you meet the person who makes you feel complete. You have known each other from the first glance of acquaintance in Mrs. Gunther's second grade class. At some point, you decided to marry. From that moment of yes to this moment of yes. Indeed, you have been making commitments in an informal way. All those conversations that began with, when we're married, and continued with, I will, and you will, and we will. All those late night talks that included someday, and somehow, and maybe. Look at one another and remember this moment in time. For after today, you shall say to the world, this is my husband, this is my wife.